Facial droop is a telltale sign of stroke, but how can drooping on one side of the face indicate an issue on the opposite side of the brain? At the higher level, the nervous system is crosswired. This means that the right side of the brain controls the left side of the body and vice versa. The frontal lobes contain special cells called motor neurons, which are responsible for initiating voluntary motor movements of the face, arm, and leg. And if blood supply to these cells is disrupted, a person may experience a symptom such as a facial droop. It is important to distinguish facial droop related to stroke from other common medical diagnoses such as a Bell's palsy. A Bell's palsy often involves both the upper and lower parts of the face, while stroke related facial droop often includes the lower part of the face and is associated with other symptoms such as speech or vision problems or arm and leg numbness and weakness. However, this is for a medical professional to figure out. And if you have this symptom, please seek medical attention. Thank you for learning with us. And remember, knowledge today leads to healthier tomorrows.